Okay, so right here we have Brakeson versus Bro Bear. Bro Bear is a very, very good zero suit. Okay, they're just going straight to Starterville. Oh, they're going with the zero suit dittos? Okay. This is weird. I have never seen Brakeson pull out the zero suit before. I'm curious to see what he does with this. He, um, throughout the entire match, or the entire tournament today, he's only been pulling out Diddy Kong. Even in doubles, just straight Diddy Kong. And this is, I'm really in, curious to see how this turns out, because I know Bro Bear is an extremely good ZSS, uh, but Brakeson has been very impressive today with his skills with Diddy Kong, so I don't know, maybe he's been low-key practicing some some zero suit. Maybe he wants to take the title away from Brobear of being one of the best zero suits in this state. Okay, let's see. What, how does this go? Okay, getting the down throw. Ooh, going for the side B. Does not get the side B. Gets the down B. Brobear is doing very, very good right now. I feel like Brakeson is not gonna, not gonna take this, but I don't know. He is very impressive with his Diddy skills, so he he could definitely surprise me or something. Oh, okay. Goes for the down B. Oh, and gets the up B. And that is the first stop taken. Bro Bear looking like he might be getting a two stop. A clean two stop. He's known for getting those clean two stops on people. And it's it's looking real, real good right now. Ooh, going for that that uppy almost hits. That would have been disgusting, but beautiful at the same time. That about sums up my opinion on Bro Bear Zero Suit. It is disgustingly beautiful. He just oof. Okay, so they're even on percent right now, but there is an entire stock separating them. So I'm pretty sure this is going to Bro Bear. Breaks in trying to get those up airs, not getting it. Oh, and goes. That's a two stock, everyone. That is a two stock. Okay, game one going to Bro Bear. Going to Bro Bear. Ooh, I'm hearing a little bit of salt from Breakson over there. Alright, let's see. He's, okay, he's gonna switch to Diddy Kong. Yep, I knew it. Okay, so his Diddy Kong is extremely impressive. Did a lot of work on some, um, on some good players today. And... I don't know. Ooh. Oh, okay. I thought he was switching. Okay. So, is Bro Bear? Bro Bear's. I'm pretty sure he's gonna stay. Okay. Yeah, he's staying. Are they going for Smashville again? Nope. They are going to maybe Duck Hunt. Okay. So they're going to Duck Hunt. That makes it a little bit harder for Bro Bear to get those those up air, up air, up air, up these. But at the same time, I'm, I have seen him still destroy extremely well on these on the stage. So let's see how this goes. Okay, Rubber getting some really good combos. They're even in percents right now. Brakeson getting some some good forward errors. Okay, Rubber grabs a banana, trades it off to Brakeson. Okay, so they're, they're they're pretty much just trading blows right now. Yep. Uh, only 10, less than 10% separating them at the moment. Going for that down smash into forward smash. Does not get it. Kills with the up B. Ooh, that custom up B is really dangerous. I was playing with him in, in doubles today, and it was, ooh, it was getting quite a few kills. Alright. So I, I feel like Brober really has to put in some work to bring this back. Because Brixen is really good on, on at Diddy Kong. He's number five on the PR, so that that can tell you quite a bit by itself. Okay, he's going for that upbeat, trying to get that that clean two stuff. Get some revenge from last game. But, okay, Ooh, looking a lot like last game to be honest. And the percents and stops. Okay, so he he gets. He gets that, that uh, no two stock for, for breaks in, and Brober could be bringing it back, trying to get that clean 2-0. Let's see it. Nope. Nope. 
Uh, breaks and takes game two. All right. Interesting. Let's see how. Let's see how this goes from here. So it is one one even right now. Anyone said uh, Robert are taking the game one very convincingly, and then breaks and taking game two very convincingly. I I don't know how this is going to this is going to go. Okay, going to Lilac Cruise. Whew. All right. To be honest, I do not know how, if this is a good map for either of them. Although I know platforms can be extremely helpful to Zero Suit, considering it was it was Burberry's counter pick. Uh, I'm guessing it is a pretty pretty all right stage for Zero Suit, or at least for Burberry Zero Suit. Okay, still trading blows quite a bit, staying pretty even in percents. Burberry getting some down air and up airs. Looking pretty hot. Oh, going for the down throw into forwarder. Throwing the banana out. Ooh. Really, really close at the moment. I, I feel like Berber is really trying, or really trying right now. Trying to get those, those sweet combos. Playing it way more safe than usual. We're going for the dash attack. Oh, gets the side B. Alright. Well, getting that another side beat. Still extremely close. I feel like Bro Bear just needs to get the stock lead, and he has this in the bag. I'm not sure. This is really close at the moment. At this point, it's any anyone can take the first stock. It's a matter of... Okay. Rakes and taking the first stock, just like last game. Although the percent difference... Er, the percent that... Breaks in the vent is much higher than he was last game. So, Grobear could go with a crazy comeback. Or, okay, taking that, oh, yep, taking that first stop. Only 28% in between, 39% now, getting a forward air with Deddy Kong from Breaks in. Alright. Okay, so Grobear is really trying to put in some work right here. Okay. So, looking really close right now. I feel like this is anyone's game. They are very closely matched players. Rober has definitely adapted quite a bit to, um, to breaks his playstyle, doing much better than last time. And he takes it. Alright, nice. 2-1 from Brakeson. Very impressive work right there. Good job on everyone. Yeah, that was that was some hot stuff. Please, please.